I am currently in Madagascar. Hi! Been here for like a couple days now. I flew here by myself. I'm not sure I'm gonna vlog much just because it's time for me to get to spend quality time with my family members here so that's what I'm doing most of the days. I have a bunch of books with me because I don't have my phone, I don't have my computer or anything so I'm not doing anything like touristy because I've been here before, I've done the touristy things. This is mostly like family time. Most of the people are people I haven't seen in a very long time. Even some I haven't even met because that's how extended the family is. It's nice being here, it's very refreshing. Everything is so slow living because I don't have to be on my phone or my computer. That's actually super, super nice. I'm appalled at how many stray dogs there are in the city. I think originally there was only like a couple of them and then they kept on having babies. There are so many, but they're so nice. Unfortunately, they kind of eat trash and they drink from like the sewer. It kind of like breaks my heart being like a dog owner. It's also the amount of people living in poverty. I'm, I'm kind of used to it because I've been here before. I've seen it before. I think when I was a kid, much younger, probably my first two times I got here, it was much more scarier because the kids I would see in the streets were my age. So it was it was striking realizing that now as an adult it's still striking but I think as a kid like it slightly showed me how privileged I was compared to them and I didn't really understand because to me I was a kid, they were kids so it was hard to comprehend it in my kid brain. food literally in 10 minutes because I was so hungry so I cannot even show you the food because it's all gone and I didn't go for dessert which I what is what I usually do because I I feel like the plate was so big um, but the place is stunning it is so beautiful we're by a pool it has like a hotel and rooms keeping it like hydrated I'll try to show you a little bit more of the inside um, and hopefully you will look good but I'm just gonna show you the pool right now because it's insanely pretty. We have memorabilia and a lot of historical, you know, instruments and um, a bunch of like you know souvenirs and it is so pretty so I'm just like going over everything and it just looks so nice Behind me is most of Tana and it is so pretty. The view is amazing. Today is kind of grayish, but it's hot. I think it's like 26 degrees. We're over 80 degrees Fahrenheit. I went to visit for the very first time my mom and my uncle's school where they grew up, where they studied. It, it is so cute and also I don't know if you can see but do you know they have like the Hollywood Hills and like the big Hollywood signs they have the same that says Antananarivo I just I just love it here it's very it's very colorful it's hot you know it has a lot of energy
and I'm just about to eat at a place and I don't know what it's called. They're gonna bring the food and I got the exact same thing. There's also like some sort of conference so there are a lot of people that are um, having some sort of buffet and um, it's right by a pool. This is what it looks like. Got the pool, some people are swimming, the conference going on. There's a lot of traffic in Tana. This is this is insane. Hey guys, today I am checking out some views. So we can have like a nice view of the city, so that's what I'm doing. So that's super super nice. This is a view that you get. Oops, sorry. This is a view that you get to see from where I am right now. I'm really liking the greenery here because I think it's stunning. Today's a new day, went to the grocery store. It's almost time for me to leave, so I wanted to show you what I got at the grocery store and we're gonna discover all this together. I got some Malagasy biscuits. So we have this one, Guti. We have uh, this one, Sokobis. And same brand, different biscuit. This one is milk biscuit. And then I went to Omeo Pharma and I got myself a pina colada um, caffeine free tea. And I got roll ons for headache and for stress. So, this is based off of essential oil, and I'm gonna put that in my bag 24 7. Everything is homemade, everything is made here from Homeo Pharma, and everything is natural. And we I got as a gift this antiviral balm. Thank you so much for watching this video to following my little adventure to Madagascar, that's nice. I hope you guys liked this video. Don't forget to subscribe, comment. I hope this vlog was uh, as nice as it was for me to, you know, experience it. Madagascar is a beautiful country, it's my country, and it is just such an eye-opening and humbling experience to get to see it you know, um, talking to people, driving around, going to different stores, going to the countryside, going to talk to farmers. I didn't have my camera all the time, tried to vlog as much as I could. Uh, so I hope you like this and I will see you soon. Bye!